653, welcome back to Breakfast Television. Well, spring break is coming up, and if you're looking to use that time to experience the magic of Disney, the Disney Parks Mom Panel is here to help. Lynn Schlala is the Canadian resident on the panel, and she joins me this morning to tell us how we can use their over 122,000 hours of Disney Parks and Resorts experience <laughs> to help make that most out of your next Disney trip. Good morning, Lynn. Good morning. This is, this is an interesting role that you play. You are an attorney. Uh, that's your, your main job. But on the side, you're also doing the Disney Parks Mom Panel. Tell us a little bit about the panel. Well, the Disney Parks Moms Panel is an online planning forum where guests who have questions about planning their Walt Disney World or their Disney Parks vacation or about any part of uh, the planning process, they can come and ask us questions and we'll give them personalized tips and insights about uh, how to go about their Disney day. So what are the most common questions that the panel gets on a regular basis? Well, we get a lot of questions, believe it or not, about whether there are refrigerators in the uh, Walt Disney World Resort hotel rooms. And yes, there are. But the questions are as varied as the panelists and as the different people who are asking us the questions. So I, some people ask me about packing tips. Some people ask us uh, about what resort they should pick for their family based on you know their kids' ages or whether or not they're even bringing their kids. So it really does cover everything. And there are specialists from Walt Disney World Resort Disneyland and Disney Cruise Line and even Disney Vacation Club. Well, I, I've been to Disney uh, World a number of times with my family, and it can be stressful if you are not prepared and you don't go, you know, go in knowing what to do. So what are some of the top tips that you would give uh, parents that are planning a trip right now? Well, the number one tip is to go online and access an online planning tool called My Disney Experience. And that's really where you can put in all of the different parts of your Disney itinerary. So your resort hotel reservation, your dining reservations, your theme park tickets, even your fast pass selections. It all gets grouped together in this one really convenient place so that people can kind of know where, they, where they're going and what they'd like to experience during their vacation. But the number one tip is to pace yourself. I know that there are a lot of different options, but it's really important to keep in mind that you won't be able to see and do everything. I'm lucky enough to go several times a year, and I still haven't seen everything that is that uh, Walt Disney World Resort has to offer in its four theme parks, two water parks, countless resorts. So it's really important to focus in on the main things you and your family want to see, and that's what My Disney Experience helps you do. Right. It can be exhausting. You almost need a vacation from the vacation <laughs> if you don't handle it properly, right? Now, what about tips specifically for Canadians? Uh, well, one of the things that I always tell Canadians to do is to always check the special offers tab on the Walt Disney World Resort website because that's where you'll see if there are any special offers, promotions, and even things like the Canadian resident special ticket offer that's currently on right now. It's a great deal. <laughs> no doubt. Almost out of time, uh, but quickly, if you had to pick the top things, the must-dos if you're heading down to Disney World, what would you, what would you select? Uh, well, now more than ever, it's such a great time to visit Walt Disney World Resort because there's so, there are so many cool things happening in each of the theme parks. I mean, you can have fun and entertainment and enjoy all the different festivals at Epcot. You can go visit Toy Story Land where you get shrunk down to the size of a toy in Andy's backyard at Disney's Hollywood Studios. One of my personal favorites is Pandora the World of Avatar at Disney's Animal Kingdom. And I mean, what's not to love about the classic at uh, you know, Magic Kingdom Park staring at Cinderella Castle and just sitting there and absorbing all the Disney magic? That is definitely a must do for me during every visit. No doubt. I have not checked out Pandora yet. Uh, that's on my list. Do you highly recommend it's it, though? so great. It is really, really incredible. It's breathtaking. Amazing. Well, thank you so much, uh, Lynn, for joining us this morning. Lynn Shalala with the Disney Parks Mom Panel joining us this morning to give us those insider tips if you happen to be checking out the park uh, maybe during spring break.